I finally decided to cook. <sighs> I'll tell you what. I'm going on vacation. I'm not doing any of this stuff anymore. The battles that I have to fight. Honey, it's not you. It's everybody. And I can't take it any longer. I'm just going to... I'm going to just not do anything. You got the beamer now. Now I can instruct you as soon as I'm done instructing you. The others can take over in the traditional way. But we've learned things behind the scenes. We can't talk about things. Oh, look at that. She's a bowl and oh, I better let her saute now. Look at that, man. Look. Wait, do you smell this? Yeah, I can cook. I can do a lot of things. I don't tell people things. I throw people off my path, if that makes any sense to you. I just throw people off my path because I just don't want to deal with things so I create things. And I've got a wild imagination. It doesn't make me a liar, though. I'm not a liar. I never have been a liar. I've told the truth as much as I've ever had to. You get punished sometimes when you're misunderstood. I love you so much. I really do. I'm so happy that I got that thing with you now. You can learn and teach the girls. These generations just don't know how to take care of certain things and they get beaten up because we didn't take responsibility when we should have. And I'm not speaking just for my generation. My dad, what, what choices did they have but to go through? You know, my dad was born in 23, my grandfather in the late 1800s. They had to take families through depressions and hell. But what's coming on the earth is gonna make that look like child's play. And I know that we're gonna be raptured out of here. Not the traditional way in which Tim LaHaye or, or uh, Hal Lindsey really screwed people up with his esthetology. I got some stuff I just want you to look at. Going to Greek and cults and all of the above. Just look at it. Tell me what you think. But I don't want to even study it because I know in my gut we're not going to be here. We're going to hide in the clefts of the rocks. We're not going to be here. But we got to keep warning people. Billion man revival is taking place right now all over the world. And this was prophesied by Bob Jones and a lot of other people that are major, major players. And then the Lord removed them from Billy Graham to Derek Prince to many, many major re revivalists. But now it's our turn to pass on the baton. But if these kids don't listen, there's nothing we can do about it. Nobody. Your mother's worth, worth listening to because we respect our elders. I don't care. Whether she makes you feel one way or the other, I know it sucks. My mother's gone, and my dad's gone. Your mother's only the last one from your generation in your family. Maybe she's got a sister or brother, I don't know, but listen to her. Bite your lip, I'll bite my lip. We have to listen to our elders. This is what's wrong with this generation. At one point in the 70s, they just threw out the baby with the bathwater. Jackie did it and gave my children license, license to disrespect. But that's going to come to an end too. Yeah, call me later. I need you. I mean, I really need you. I hate showing that I need, have a need. But I do. And I know that it's going to all turn out. Hey, uh, Brian, how I'm, are you? Buddy? I'm just going to stay home tomorrow. Okay, you want something to eat? Hey, I made some something really good. What is it? Well, it's a, a combination of a lot of different things. Sure. You know, let me, let me, let, it's just got a little cooking to do and then. Okay. You, you like warm food? Oh, yeah. All right, all right, buddy. All right. Yeah, I'm gonna stay home too myself tomorrow. All right. Yeah, I just I just don't want to get out in that hot car. All right. So, yeah, I don't blame you.